Hi, my name is Laura Carr. I'm the founding director at Children of the Father's House here in Bremerton, Washington, and also our NGO in Kampala, Uganda. So our family has three children and uh, my husband wanted to have another and I thought he was crazy. So I told him maybe we would think about adopting and so we had the opportunity to pursue that in a foreign country and we started down the road to do that in Uganda. Worst came to worst and the visa process just completely fizzled out. And it turned out after three attempts to the embassy to get them approved, um, the whole orphanage actually ended up homeless and on the street instead of this little boy coming home to be part of our family. And I just found myself in this position and my husband um, together, we just decided that there was no way we could just walk away and leave them where they were. Um, it was really a crisis of conscience moment and a test of faith to say, I don't know how we're gonna do this. Like, this isn't my training. I, I, my degree's in finance. I was working at the shipyard at that time. I was not a person who was known as a missionary. It's just an average mom. And yet, when I thought about those kids, and it was like, what if that was my child? So we just, took a huge leap of faith. We emptied our whole savings account that year. We rented them a new house in the city of Kampala. So many people were saying, how do you even know this is legit? How do you know that you're not getting scammed to come back to the house and see the kids that I've seen in pictures, that have seen me in pictures? And at first, you know, they're shy, tippy toe up, like, are you even real? Like as a mom, getting to nurture kids who don't have a mom is such a deep sense of fulfillment. And like, it's just the biggest honor and blessing to get that privilege. God's plans are always bigger than my plans. And that is something he's been teaching me over and over again in this mission is that like, you think this is what you're gonna do, Laura Carr, but I've got a much, you need to ask bigger, you need to look bigger at what I've got in mind. And um, we thought, you know, as a family, we've got room for one more child. And so one child has now turned into 29, which we know we're not done. 